What's up everyone? It is Wednesday. Hey everyone, it's Wednesday. I'm home from work. My wife has uh, open house with her school today. My youngest daughter is away at a field hockey game. She's not playing. She's on the DL with her knee. Uh, so it's just me and my oldest daughter today. Uh, so we're going to do some frozen pizza for supper tonight. Love frozen pizza. I love it when my wife's not home with the frozen pizza because then I can go nuts on them. So I'll be making those in a second. First thing I got to do is it's five o'clock. So dogs need to be fed. Leisha's over here, our black lab, and she's chomping at the bit because she knows it's five o'clock and it's time to eat. So she's having a fit right now. So I'm going to feed them and going to get the pizza started. under a minute she ate her food and she's still going at it <coughs> are you a pig huh are you a little piggy where do you belong right now where do you belong right now got you you can eat Can eat your supper. Good oh boy. It'll take forever to eat. Don't no. You're not dropping the kibble on the carpet. You know better than that. That's it. Good oh boy. Oh, that stuff that I put in his food that's coconut oil. And it actually is helping him because if you notice, it took. Took. Sit. You notice on his nose right here, he's really sensitive. That's not a snarl. That's just, it's sensitive. See? On his nose, he lost all his fur up there. And it's starting to come back now with that. And his fur is so much softer now. Poor thing was losing all his fur. Yeah, you were a mess, weren't you? Mm. And you hear someone going by, huh? Why don't you go eat your supper, Tuke? Go eat your supper. Now? And just leave a little bit there to torture Alicia. So you can eat it later on when she wants it. Alright, so what I'm going to do now is we're going to have pizza. So this oven takes forever to heat up. So I'm going to start heating it up right now. It's 425. Let's go down and get a frozen pizza out of the freezer. Let's see what I got in the refrigerator that I can doctor up the pizza with. So let's see what we got in here for pizzas. Italian favorites. Classic crust. Yeah. I like the rising crust with all the gobbly gook on it. Yeah, well, we're, we're going to have to take this one. I'm going to bring up two. Because I know if I don't make two, my wife and my daughter, youngest daughter, are going to be hungry. Um, but if I make two, they're going to have already gotten something to eat. So I'll make two. We'll have extra pizza. I can have pizza for breakfast tomorrow. All right. So I was wrong on the temperature. It's actually 400. Just turn the oven down, waiting for that to preheat. Let's set up the pizzas now. <laughs>
let it sit for a minute for the cheese to solidify a little bit and I love doctoring the frozen pizza. So we'll see how it came out. All right, everyone down in the office right now, since I already determined that this IMAX piece of crap, I shouldn't say that it's not a piece of crap, but I can't use it for what I want to use it. I'm going to get it off the desk. I'll store it until I can sanitize it and sell it. Uh, I'm going to set up the good iMac. I'm, I'm looking to purchase a secondary monitor, but I have one from my old gateway. And I'm going to see if I can get it to work with the iMac. So let's see if that works. If that does work, then I'll save myself a lot of money. I don't have to buy a new monitor. So let's get this going. So what I have here is I've got two adapters that I bought. Uh, I tried them at my day job, they didn't work. Uh, so with the monitor I had there. So I'm gonna try them here. Uh, this one here is the one I'm most likely gonna use. This is the mini display port. Actually, this is light. Uh, yeah, this is mini display port to HDMI. That's probably what I'll have to use for when I get the new monitor. But this one here is mini display port to VGA. This monitor is VGA, so hopefully this works. So what I'm gonna do right now is, let's boot this puppy up. Right, take a second for it to come up. While that's booting up, let's take the VGA adapter Let's plug it into the VGA cable. All right, so what I'm going to do, let's spin the iMac around here. Okay, and what I'm going to do, I'm not going to show you. Basically, I'm plugging this into the mini DVI port back in the back. Actually, it's lightning on this, so it should work. I believe it's the same thing. Well, it's plugged in. Trying to find the monitor. All right, so this monitor is not gonna work. I didn't think that it would. I gave it a shot though. Let's unplug that. All right, so that's not gonna work. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this off. Okay. Shut the, this monitor down. That's another thing I gotta take to the trash. That's a waste. Stinks. So what I'm going to do is I am going to get the DVI, not DVI, HDMI, and take it from my PlayStation and the TV up here. Let's see if it works. So I don't want to go out and buy a, a what do you call it, a new monitor if it's not going to work. So let's plug that HDMI in. Let's turn this TV on. And we'll plug this in. Yeah. What the heck? Why won't it recognize it? I know my MacBook recognizes it. Alright, let's try logging in here. Think HTML. I won. All right, I'm going to have to come back to you guys in just a second. All right, everyone. Let me zoom in a little bit. Zoom out a little bit here, actually. It'll help. I don't know what I did. Couldn't tell you. Plugged it in, plugged it out a couple of times, the HDMI connector. It's working now. Uh, what I can do here is I have this on the main screen of the iMac and then on my HDMI TV, I can use it as secondary. So what I can do is I can come over here and on this screen and open up iTunes. So what I can do is I can drag 
iTunes onto this here. All right, so basically what I can do here is <clears throat> I can use the two screens. So this means what I'm going to do is I'm going to order another monitor, and I'll do that tonight. Um, probably have it in early next week. Uh, imagine if I could set this up with three monitors. This would be beautiful. All right, so what we need to do here, let me zoom you guys in. See the monitor instead of my ugly mug. So it looks like we got the dual monitor working pretty well here. Let's shut all this down. Let's cancel that. And so I'll have to play around with that later on. So now what we're going to do. Yeah, we're good. All right, so I got the dual monitors to work here. I'm happy with that. So now I'm going to, like I said, I'll order the um, the new monitor shortly. So I'll be back with you guys in just a second. All right. So what I got going here now, I'm going to try this for now until I can get the monitor in. Uh, I have a 32-inch HDMI TV that I have hooked up. I'm going to hook it up. I still have to plug the HDMI in the back. Uh, to use as a dual monitor. So let's see how this works. Hopefully this works. This should work. Input 4 was HDMI. I think that's going to be my Chromecast. Yep. So, there we go. Look at that. Not the greatest in the world, but it'll work for now. Oh, it's flickering a little bit on the recording here. This is not flickering. So this is basically what I want. But like I said, I'm going to order a 27-inch monitor. Um, this is how it's going to be set up. So I am happy this actually worked. It took me a while, but it actually works. So I think we're good to go. I am so happy right now that it finally worked. But... All right, so let's clean this desktop up, make sure everything's working fine now. I am happy. Beauteous. See, one good thing I have Chromecast on this here. So if I go and go to input four, grab my cell phone. Okay, bring up Netflix on there. It's Chromecast. Downstairs. And there we go. So I can watch Netflix down here too. The other thing that I can do is with the iPhone, I have an app called TV. Click on that. All right. That didn't work. But anyway, I can I can stream right from my right here. Uh, if I go over to Netflix, there you go. So I can watch TV while I'm working. Nice. So disconnect from that. Let's see how this work. The epics. There we go. So I don't watch movies down here. Too. Oh, this is going to work beautiful. I may not want to put it back. <laughs> I may want to stay with this. All right. So it does exactly what I wanted it to. This is this is absolutely beautiful. And I'm sorry, I keep on looking at the mo the flip out screen for for the camera, and I should be looking at the lens. But so, all right. All right, so let me clean up down here, and I will get back with you guys real short. Hey, everyone, that's going to be it for tonight. Thanks for watching. I do appreciate it. Uh, I was able to get that monitor, the second monitor, to work with my old iMac. Uh, I think it's going to be great to do editing down there. So I'll be doing that soon. Uh, yeah. So thanks for watching. If you like the video, 
click right here, a little thumbs up. And if you're not a subscriber, click subscribe over here. You can see all the videos I've done over the past four plus years. If you click that little bell icon, you'll get a notification of any time I put up a video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys again soon.